Hello and welcome to Chinese Zero to Hero. As you all know, when you are listening to spoken Chinese, whether a recorded lecture, downloaded podcast, or any audio in Chinese, it's great to have an accurate transcription of the speech you're listening to, so you can check your comprehension. Unfortunately, not all of your audio may come with an accurate transcript. Is there any way for us to somehow use AI to generate an accurate transcription of an audio file? The answer is yes, and you can do that for free. Today, I'll show you how you can get an accurate textual transcription of any Chinese audio file using the free version of Google Gemini. You'll be able to get an accurate transcript so you can better understand the Chinese being spoken and learn any new vocabulary item you may run into. The process involves three steps. Step one: If the audio file is longer than ten minutes, you need to split the audio file into ten-minute segments. And step two: Upload the MP3 audio files to Google Gemini for transcription. And finally, step three: copy the results to language player to better study it. Now, let me show you each one of the steps. Here's an audio file of a podcast episode downloaded to my computer. Now, let's go to Google Gemini and upload the file. And let's paste in the prompt: "Please provide a transcription of this audio in simplified Chinese, no timestamps necessary." And press send. But Gemini here tells us that it looks like the audio file was too long. Try uploading a shorter one. Gemini can only handle audio files up to ten minutes long. To solve this problem, we split the file into multiple parts, and then upload each part. To split the audio, we can use this website right here. Now let's upload our audio file. Choose ten minutes as the split interval. Click Split Now. Now we wait for a few seconds. Once finished. We click download right here, and now we get a zip file containing three parts. Let's upload the first part to Gemini, then enter the text prompt: "Provide a transcription in simplified Chinese, please. No timestamp necessary." As for the model, let's choose fast, since reasoning is not necessary in this case. But if you find the result not accurate enough, try switching to thinking. Now let's choose send. As you can see, it takes only a few seconds to get a full, fairly accurate transcription in simplified Chinese. You can repeat the same process for the other two parts. Once the transcription is done, we can now copy the output into Language Player for study. Let's click the Copy button to copy the text. Then we go to Language Player, which can be accessed from the URL languageplayer.io. You need to create a free user account if you haven't done so already. Once you're in, make sure that Chinese is the language being studied, as indicated by the flag on the top right corner. Now let's navigate to Reading. Then create a new text. Then paste in where we copied from Gemini. Now, as you can see. The text is now interactive, and we can click on any word to look it up. We can get an AI explanation of any expression that is unclear by pressing on this button. Note that the AI feature is only available for Pro users. If you are a free user, you need to upgrade to Pro to be able to use this feature. And right now is a perfect time to upgrade because we have a Black Friday sale, so you can upgrade to Pro at 50% off. The offer ends on December first. Our HSK courses are also on sale at thirty percent off. And that is how you can get an accurate text transcription from any audio file and study it with Language Player. Go ahead and give it a try. If you have found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And if you have any questions, please feel free to leave a comment. I'll answer any comment that's left within one week of the upload date. In our next video, we'll deliver a 15-minute task-based HSK three-level lesson that will teach you some very useful expressions that you will need when you travel to China. If you're interested, please make please make sure to subscribe to this channel and turn on the bell icon so that you'll be notified when the lesson becomes available. And that's it for this video. You can use these links here to explore more of our content or sign up to our HSK courses. I'll see you in our next video. Bye.